Managing a hospital is a huge challenge. It requires looking beyond the horizon, beyond the day-to-day, -day, and sometimes making tough decisions in crisis situations. As the CEO of Rambam, and also as a grandfather, I find myself wondering how we will care for these children's medical needs 20, 30, or even 40 years from now. Profoundly committed to pioneering medical services in northern Israel, both now and in decades ahead, the entire management team has come together to shape a common vision and an intergenerational master plan that will secure a healthy future for all our children and for many generations to come. Nine or ten new high-rises, some with more than 30 floors, will gradually replace most of the current buildings, making the campus five times bigger than it is today, with two and a half times more beds. This will enable us to fulfill our vision for a campus where health and well-being takes center stage and where we can provide the best medical care to everyone who comes to our doors. From using stem cells to repair damaged organs through innovative imaging technology, state-of-the-art laboratories will help our medical teams provide patients with the best possible care, including slowing the aging process and preventing disease through early diagnosis. This medical campus promotes recovery and prevents illness within a healing environment that is not a luxury, but an absolute necessity, where all the inpatient room, treatment centers, and open areas will convey the calm, relaxing atmosphere. Rambam will be a shining light for medicine, a beacon where research, innovation, and advanced technology are combined. Future generations will be taught how to keep dreaming, building, and healing. I've been working at Rambam for 37 years, including the last four years as CEO. This is, to my mind, the most significant event of my term. Bigger than a pandemic, bigger than anything else I will ever do. A groundbreaking master plan for a groundbreaking medical center. Rambam 2065, creating the future of medicine.